Hello everybody, welcome back to The Glitch, Fable Episode 10, right where we left off in this lovely little uh, courtyardy type area with the statue. Now that statue's pointing that way, just notice that. It's pointing to Greatwood. Is it now? Well, that is exactly where I'm heading, because I think that's where you get a fishing rod from. And uh, you'll notice... While I was there, in ba in, while I was in Bowstown looking around, I bought some light leather pants. Some leather trousers. So, uh, I'm going to go this way. I thought it makes me look a little bit better. Not that good looking, but I'm going to head this way and uh, get that fishing rod. <gasps> Enemies. The quest for the mushroom continues. And there's always people to save. Just hit this guy in the face. Oh, the trader standing up for himself. Oh god, no, I've got to save him quick. Did I kill him? Right, let's get out of this. We've got to save him. He's going to die if I don't get there in time. Yeah! Pathetic. Sit down. Sit down. Where's the other guy? Take some of that. Oh, don't worry. It's going to hit him with my bow, but no. Yeah, And we'll finish him off. Oh, he's got a green gem at the bottom of his sword. Lovely. Let's pull out this bow. Thank you. I've saved your life. Right, your head's gone, buddy. There it goes. Okay, let me check the map quick. Where's that leading me to? Greatwood Lake. Where we're heading is Fisher Creek. I hope, anyway. Die! Yeah. Okay. So I've got a few new spells. That's my force push. Well, I've got one new spell. That's my dash. That's my armor shield. So we'll try that in a sec. Come here, you tosser. Yeah. Lots of, lots of gold. Can never get it out in time. To hit them. God, this is decimating them, this thing. Okay, so press the right stick to get your map up. We're going to ignore the flashing thing, because that's just leading us to... Uh, it's just leading us back to uh, Oakvale, I believe. We're going to go up. Die! That was, oh, I thought I had lightning on. That was my shield. Shield of power. We're heading up this way to Fisher Creek. Ah, little cut scene. Help! Help me! <gasps> no! They're everywhere. We'll Hold save you. Out. Us and the flame tarner. Yeah! Oh. oh, it was so much effort. Oh. It's gonna be glowing. Oh, thank you, young lad. It's alright. I ain't cast me line for so long, I got me the shakes. Been <laughs> eating bait worms all week. That Couldn't have come at a worse time either. I've got me a fishing competition to organise. Oh, really? I tell you what, I'll give you free entry to the competition. <laughs> Least I could do. Brilliant. You'll be Thank you. This here fishing rod. Look at Made my face. Myself. Fishing rod. We got our fishing rod. All you need to do is cast your rod over one of them ripples there. Okay. Fishing hook income. The fishing hook icon should appear on one of the buttons on the D-pad. Press the relevant button, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so we're not going to do this here. We're going to stop this. And we're going to head back to the guild. To the demon door. And fish up that shroom. Back in the guild. Let's quickly get this mushroom and save that young guy. We failed last time getting the mushroom, but uh, it sprung to mind when I was running running around where to get it from. Right. Off towards the demon door. Oh, 
Okay, here we are. Look, I'm still glowing. It's beautiful. I look so energized. I've had my power aid. I think it's until it will last until I get hit. So here we go. Let's cast my line. Get a good old hook. Get some bait. Come on. Wait until you feel a bite on the hook and press the A button to start reeling it in. To reel in the fish and make the catch, keep pressing the A button. When the fish reaches the left side of your bar, you've caught it. Okay, so there's a bit of a challenge. Be careful not to reel it when it's in. Be careful not to reel it in when it's pulling, or the line may snap under the strain. The bar will turn from green to red as the strain increases. Okay. Shit. Got that turned red almost instantly. Okay. Second attempt. Even though it's a mushroom we're pulling up. At least I hope it's a mushroom. I'm not going to fuck up. A mushroom that is alive. Oh, I understand. Come on, come on. Got you. What have I got? Come on. Yeah, the mushroom. Right, now I'm not sure if we take it back to those druggies or we take it to the witch first. Let's see. So we're back here with the witch, the Bowstone Key. I don't know if that's how it's pronounced or not. Uh, you don't give it back to those uh, couple of nutcases because uh, they weren't there anymore. So let's pass on the mushrooms to this lovely woman. Yes. These will be perfect. Uh, just give me a few hours and, uh... Well, few hours? What do you know? Oh. I've got some of the potion already. You fucking bitch. <laughs> Mind like a sieve, I All of that time. I've gone around for that mushroom. All those shrooms. Son of a bitch. I'll just, um, uh, uh, put them somewhere safe. <laughs> yes. Uh, bye now. She's just going to pass them on to the next poor sod just to fuck him up. Son of a bitch. She's played us all. <gasps> I had to plug in my laptop because it was running out of battery. Right, now let's go save the poor sod. Where is he? He's down the hill here, isn't he? Not far, it's just, just here. Wasn't much of a walk. Past this lovely big tree. We're here! Is that him springing on his feet? It is. It's that bully guy. Love those things. <laughs> I still can't believe the old woman really helped us. Mm. I'll never join another witch-burning mob after this. Well, she didn't really help, did she? Let's be honest. We won't forget your kindness, hero. Good luck with your quest. Thank you so much. It was a pleasure. Two hundred renown. Thank you. I'm getting more and more famous by the minute. What's down here? Okay, they're locked. So we've done it. We completed the quest of the shrooms. Let's see what else we've got to do. And that that's a good answer for my uh, question last episode. If you should take if you take the mushrooms or not. That young guy there, good example of why not to. Okay. So uh, while we're here, we'll visit the barber to have a haircut with this guy. And once we've done that, we'll continue on to Twinblade. So this should be a bar, but I just hope the shop's not closed. If it is, then we'll have to spend the night at the tavern. Okay, so we slept in the tavern. Had a good old rest. Let's go see if we can buy this thing. What did he want? He wanted the pudding basin out haircut. Just doesn't look great from what I understand. Hello, Scarlet. Let's cut my hair, please. The buzz, the pudding basin. It's extremely scary, apparently. A scary haircut. Right, pudding basin. Waste of my fucking money. Look at it, I look like a right dork. Alright, let's go talk to this, this guy. Get in with his door. Right, 
is just down here, I believe. I know, I should say. <laughs> Hi, hello. Hello again. Hello just again. Just about the perfect haircut. My daughter will be very happy. Mm, good, good. But I forgot, she also prefers men with beards that look a lot like the one on this card. Okay. Mutton chop beard. Imposing and eccentric. Bob will be able to give you this style. Brilliant. Come back and see me when you've got a beard like that. Okay. Don't worry, I won't wander too far. Right. Back up the hill to get my ho my uh, beard put on. Look at that. Look at my mutton chops. Looking good. Apparently it puts up your attractiveness by 48. Which is really quite bizarre. Right, back to the old guy. Right, here I am, you sod. Oh hello, nice beard. Thank you. You're really starting to look the part now. Thank you. No I hope she likes though. me. Didn't I mention she loves the one on this card? No, you failed to mention that. Good grief! Look at that thing. Facial hair of the wandering merchants of Albion. A barber will give you this style. You better hurry along. Come and find me again when you're ready. Ah. <sighs> you won't have to look far. My daughter will be so happy. Right. BRB. <laughs> oh, yeah. Look in the part now. Yes. Look at that. What do you have to say nice for yourself? Selection of face fungus you have there. Excuse me. But to be honest, I don't give two hoots what you look like. And neither does my daughter. You what? She doesn't even exist. I just like making heroes like you look stupid. <gasps> I don't... I, I, I don't know if he realises, but I have a knife on my side of my arm with this equipment. Not all of my weapons have been taken away. Oh. So here's a little reward. Now go and have a shake. For God damn it, I'm gonna have Fire Monkey Tattoo. Thank you. Is that it. You know, part of me wants to fucking kill the bastard. Look at my sight. Look at my face. I look ridiculous. Right. I'm gonna go to the barbers. And get this all cleaned off of me. Fucking bar. Get out of my fucking way, chicken. Holy shit. Yeah, that was all my anger. Okay, so we're all clean shaven and our face is back to normal. Our hairs are slightly different, I think. It looks a bit ridiculous, actually, but no matter. We've had a shave. We got we saved the young boy down there. Got the mushrooms for him. Uh, we've done that stupid quest by that guy. We've got a tattoo out of it, I guess. And uh, I think that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Next stop will be Twin Blades Camp and we'll find the Cirrus. Find out about our sister. And question of this episode. What hairstyle in the games, or all Fable games, would you like to have? Or would you go with something ridiculous like that guy gave me? Or with that crazy trader moustache? It was pretty epic, but I wouldn't wear one. So let me know in the comments below. Leave a like if you enjoyed this episode. And uh, hit the channel up with a subscribe. We would much appreciate it and we'd be very, very, very happy. So I shall see you all in the next episode.